Minister of Tourism and Aviation, the Honorable Dionysia Diagular, revealed to delegates at the closing of the week-long State of the Tourism Industry Conference that in the first six months of 2018, the Bahamas saw 15.4% increases in stopover visitors, and based on the projected numbers, the Bahamas is well-positioned for continued growth. He says the key to ensuring this happens is through awareness campaigns, both at the national and regional levels. And we have, you know, obviously certain advantages over our neighbors. We're closer. Uh, we've got 16 different destinations. Uh, we're English speaking. We're on the same time zone as the, uh, as, as, as our major, the Eastern Seaboard. Um, very easy to get to. People are familiar with the Bahamas. We're trying to get people to, to, to venture out of their safety zone, though, which is Nassau Paradise Island. You know, you come here, but add on. Go down to Exuma. Go swim with the bigs. Go go fly fishing in Andrus. Go to Abaco and, 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 and you know, experience all the different islands there, the, the sort of old historical colonial culture. And you know what? It, it's working. I mean, Abaco's numbers are up double digits. Eleuthera is doing very well. Exuma is doing very well. So start with the Caribbean, come to the Bahamas, and then funnel them through our 16 different destinations. With SOTIC 2018 now in the history books, Minister Diagler says the push continues to get more heads in beds. That push, he says, must incorporate marketing, collaboration and integration. It really, really is very important for us to, to pool our resources and, 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 and get a greater bang for buck. So, um, and I think we're doing, I mean, the Bahamas is certainly doing very well uh, for six months of the year. Uh, stopover visitors are up 15.4%. So I'm, I'm very excited with, with how well we're doing. I, I hear the July numbers are good as well. So um, we're, we're certainly, uh, um, the Bahamas is still front and center in, in many minds of the traveling public when they want to come to the Caribbean, and that's good. And I think we're being and we've got a, an awesome um, uh, new campaign coming out in, at the beginning of the year. So we're, 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 we're pushing on all cylinders. We're, we're very excited about uh, um, tourism for the next, at least, you know, you've got about six months. Six months are looking good. Speaking to all the major hotels, things are looking good. So I'm very encouraged.